Have you ever heard of the story, the old Cherokee tale, the tale of two wolves? It's basically about people who have a battle going on inside them all the time. Now, the battle is with two wolves, and the one wolf is evil, and it has thoughts of, you know, uh, jealousy and um, hatred and sorrow and greed and things of that nature. And the other wolf is a, a good wolf, and that wolf um, has thoughts of love and peace and joy and kindness and, and things like that. And the tale goes um, that the Cherokee chief is talking to his grandson about these two wolves and the grandson says, well, Grandpa, which wolf wins this battle that's going on in us? And the grandfather says, the one that you feed. And isn't that so true? Which wolf are we feeding? Hi, it's Pamela Tansley. And today I'm going to talk about feeding the wolf. So how do you feed your good wolf? If you want to your good wolf to win, what sorts of things do you have to feed your good wolf? Well, the number one thing to do is to feed it the good and positive thoughts. What are you focusing your mind on? What are you watching? What are you reading? And who are you listening to? Feeding your good wolf is all about putting in the good and positive things inside of you to get that wolf to feed on, on that. If you are watching, uh, always watching things like news that um, have, you know, MDK, I call it, murder, death, kill, uh, you are going to be feeding your evil wolf. If you are listening to people who are always negative and complaining and um, criticizing, you are feeding your negative wolf. So, in order to feed your good, positive wolf, we need to be putting things into us that are good and positive, like listening to positive, uplifting uh, audios and videos and reading things that are positive and good. This is how we feed our, our good wolf. Now sometimes it seems like it's a, a very difficult thing to do because we wake up in the morning and you know something goes wrong and it's uh, nothing is right or you know, you woke up with a kink in your back and then you accidentally spilled your coffee and then you stepped outside and, you know, stepped on something in a puddle or, you know, things just keep going wrong over and over and over. You got to stop and think, am I feeding the good wolf or the bad wolf? Am I, do I have thoughts of negativity that is drawing more thoughts of negativity or do I have positive good thoughts that are drawing to me more positive good energy? because we know that everything is energy, including thoughts. Thoughts are energy. Thoughts are energy that manifest into your life. So if you are putting good, positive thoughts into your mind and into your brain, you are going to be drawing that positive energy to you and manifesting everything in your life in a positive way. So that is my tip for the day. And I hope that you get some value from this. And please feel free to like, share, and comment on this video. And I will see you next time. Thanks.